this was a moving and unusual dedication today at this bridge in Jamaica Plain, newly named for Alexander and Brian Arredondo. More than a dozen years ago, Alex was killed fighting in Iraq, and then there was another tragedy for the family. His younger brother, Brian, took his own life. Well, their father, of course, became a recognizable hero from the Boston Marathon bombings and says that this bridge and the honor have special meaning. These brothers shared a strong bond in life, and we'll be naming this bridge as a tribute not only to that bond, but to the continued perseverance of their family. The Jamaica Way Bridge, dedicated to the memory of 20-year-old Marine Lance Corporal Alexander Arredondo, killed in Iraq in 2004. This is about the pain that comes from losing a family member lost on the field of combat. And his brother Brian, whose grief over his older brother's death led to his suicide six years later in 2011. They were the children of Victoria Foley. Alex and Brian were everything to me. My wonderful, inspiring, loving sons. And Carlos Arredondo, the man in the cowboy hat, whose heroics helping Jeff Bowman at the Boston Marathon bombing brought his story to national attention. The bridge now named for his sons played a special role in Arredondo's life as he came to this country. This is the first bridge as an immigrant I crossed to Jamaica Plain when I come to Boston. He clutched the picture he calls the American dream and spoke about the difficulty Gold Star families face. It's no scripts. Some of us come out and do a public event. Some of us stay behind, uh, grieving the process that take a long time. And it's very, very hard on all those families. This was a really beautiful ceremony. There's also a post office in Jamaica Plain named for Alex, but the governor said today this honors the sacrifice of the entire family. And the Arredondo Foundation offers free suicide prevention training, which they say may have saved their younger son. It's a beautiful tribute to a uh, very good family.